I'm a massive Star Wars fan. Yep. I also haven't played Knights of the Old Republic. Do you know why though? Why? Didn't have an Xbox. Right. Or a PC. And we were talking before, you're not aware of the spoiler in it. So everyone in the chat, don't stay the spoiler because Floppy hasn't... I'm aware there is a spoiler. Like there is a thing. Mm -hmm. And I've somehow... I don't know how because I haven't exactly really tried hard to avoid it. I've avoided it and I don't know. But I now own an original Xbox and I'm thinking I will play this. Mm, Well, if you wait a little bit longer, it's been confirmed basically by Jason Schreier that it is being remade by Asper. Uh, in a recent interview, Jason Schreier stated, this is uh, this is public at this point. I've basically confirmed that Asper, which is the company that's ported a bunch of uh, Knights of the Old Republic games, is working on the remake. And this is also being corroborated by Eurogamer. Uh, Asper previously worked on the ports of Episode 1 Podracer and Jedi Outcast. They were great. They were. They were really, really cool. Um, so I have high hopes for this. Uh, I've never played it, but I think I might sit down and give it a crack. Brayden... You played KOTOR? Uh, so you guys know how much of a big Star Wars fan I am. Yeah, huge. Uh, massive, massive Star Wars fan. Like, classically rave about Attack of the Clones all yeah, the time. Yeah, uh, you know, uh, it's r- coarse and rough and it gets everywhere. Brayden, ha- yeah, he just hates Jar Jar Binks one of my favourite characters. He, have- Brayden goes down to the beach and just yells at Sam. Yeah. I've seen him do it. Yeah. Don't you have Yoda tattooed on your butt cheek? Uh, no, that's right next to my, that's my Jar Jar one you're mixing it up. Mm. Yeah, sorry. Mm. Um, so. And, uh, mm. Yoda's and on the, your heart. the Gungan... General What's really well. cool is that Braden got a, uh, a microchip and planted into his buttock as well. So mm. whenever he poops, he goes, "Ooh, yucky poo!" in Judge's voice. Because mm. it's got a little, it's got a little sensor on the toilet seat. Mm. Um, I bring it. I want to see that. I bring that toilet seat with no, me. No, what, what's worse is his Jar Jar impression when he gets his prolapsed. No, uh, yeah. Continue. Um, <laughs> I've never played Kotor. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's forgotten ridiculous. what that conversation was. It was just I never had a PC as when when this came out, and I were had, you even alive when this came out? I guess I was alive when this came out. Okay. I think um, how alive? Uh, well, that's <laughs> that's still. And jury's out. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I, I love Star Wars so much. And I always remember hearing about it being like, man, I really got to play this game. But I never had a PC, so I never checked it out. And I have a PC now, and I now own it. But now that there's these talks of a possible of a remake coming out, I'm like, do I go back and play this? Or do I just wait till the new You're one? a big fan. Do you not want to experience it like original? Yeah. And he's a fan of the yeah. prequels and the re-releases. Yeah. Okay. He doesn't do original. I like the new one. I, I, no, I love. It. So I don't talk shit on the originals. The originals are fucking awesome. No, 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 no. The the um, special editions of the originals. Oh, the special editions. Oh. 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 Yeah. See, thank you. Oh. Point. The nineteen nineties ones. Yeah.